Hello, today we will be going over how to perhaps to record using a Z drummer. Now there are a number of ways of doing this. Now say for instance you have a rolling drum set which you don't see in here. You see in the Alicia's Nitro. And by so it does not recognize in the uh, ASIO program which is this program right here. And if you have a rolling kit or a higher end kit, you would notice that it would say rolling TD30, 25, uh, 20, whatever you got. And you would click it and you would use your module for a, basically in a nutshell, an external sound card. But unfortunately, I haven't got it to recognize my Alicia's Nitro that way. So therefore, I am forced to have an external sound card in order to do this. And as you can look and see right here is the external sound card. You will have the ability to do the headphones or to record inside. Now the little squeaking you hear is because of this sound card isn't big enough. So I need a bigger sound card in order to stop that. But meanwhile that's something else I got to deal with. Pole man has pole more ways. That said, okay, so if your module, if you, I'm using examples with the Alicia's Nitro because uh, a lot of people has Alicia's Nitro and uh, may have sold a few for Alicia's, uh, wish they'd give me an upgrade on it because of it, but nevertheless, uh, uh, I, I have a lot of uh, uh, people that has these kits, so I will be using this kit for an example Being that I don't have a set of TD 30s sitting here <laughs> or uh, the new striker kit or Crimson or something another such as that now your Crimson and your uh, striker kits all of those would recognize in this part But some of your lower end drums is not going to do it So you would need that external sound card. I was talking about and you will need this connected to EZ Drummer, which it is, as earlier videos, I went over why you need that ASO program. And from, you will need the EZ Drummer program, you will also need a, a web program, and of course you will need a webcam, which be hit, hanging from the ceiling, or somewhere close to your drum kit, and you will need a music player. And this and this is this the software that's already in Windows 10, Windows 8, Windows 7, whatever yours is. Okay, that is some software that you will need. And the external sound card and a bunch of stinking cords. You will have to use both sound cards to record. You will send the drums to one and the music to another one, which they are settings such as Right here, you click, right click on your speaker and all your settings are in there. And you may even have to download some software to even do that. But I'm using the Pyrewood speaker, which has a mixer lock in the back of it. And that allows me to run it all into it, bring it out into the computer to record. Now, if you don't have a Pyrewood speaker, you might need a small type mixer board in order to do this. I don't really know, but that's something to take a note of on recording. So that is some setups, and you know, as I said, you need all these cords.